for regular tech updates and to support this channel please click below on this button to subscribe and to get instant notification of the new videos uploaded on this channel click on this bell button in this ever evolving technology world every day we get to see some of the other upgrade keep coming for the applications or the gadgets we use but today in this video i'm going to talk about a slight downgrade which amazon's fire tv stick has brought to us yes they have removed youtube application from their platform here in this video i will tell you how can we still use youtube on the fire tv stick my name is rakesh and you're watching tech today if you are a fire tv stick user by now you would have realized that youtube application has been removed from this platform but amazon has got an alternative for us today in this video i'm going to tell you about the alternative which amazon has brought to us on the fire tv platform through which we can still watch youtube videos so without wasting any time let's get into the video let's switch on the tv and the fire tv stick And now whenever we are trying to launch the YouTube application on the Fire TV stick, we are getting this message. It does not say that YouTube application has been removed from the Fire TV stick. However, it suggests an alternative, rather two alternatives. Recently, Amazon Fire TV stick has introduced internet browsers to this platform. One, a very popular one, Firefox, and the other one is Silk. So now to use YouTube on the Fire TV stick, click on any of these two links. I'm clicking on this Firefox option. So as soon as I clicked it, it has taken me to a download application option. Here we need to download the Firefox for Fire TV application, which is an internet browser. Click on this download button and your Firefox application will start downloading on your Fire TV stick. Here the browser is getting installed. Once it's done, Click on open. And this is the interface of this browser. Here we have already got some shortcuts for some popular applications. YouTube is also available here. You can choose the shortcuts from these available options or you can write down your requirement in the search bar like this and your website will get open. You can see here I'm going to YouTube through the search bar option instead of this shortcut. The first thing, this application gives us an option to sign in the YouTube. Once you choose to sign in, we get this code. Now to sign in the YouTube on the Fire TV stick, we need to open youtube.com slash activate either on our phone or on the computer. So I will show you through my phone how to sign into YouTube on Fire TV stick. Go to your browser option on your phone and type youtube.com slash activate. Here we get this option. We need to enter the code which was reflecting on the TV screen. You can see the code which I have entered on my phone is the same which is reflecting on my TV. Once the code is entered, click on the next option. You can choose the Google account which you'd want to use for YouTube login. Here we need to give some permissions to YouTube. To do that, click on allow here. And that's it. Now we are successfully logged into the YouTube on the Fire TV stick. The Fire TV remote is completely compatible with this browser. Whatever application we will use on this, we can browse it through the Fire TV remote. Here you can browse your YouTube using your Fire TV remote conveniently. You can forward the video, rewind it or pause it using this remote here. 
So that's how you can continue to use YouTube on your Fire TV stick. So that's it for now. I hope you'd have enjoyed this video and it was helpful for you. If you have really liked it, hit the like button given below. Until now, if you have not subscribed to our channel, hit that red button which is given below. And also don't forget to hit that bell icon which will give you instant notifications about the videos which we keep on uploading on this channel. Thanks for watching Tech Today.